Hi, this is Cecilia from Tarot by Cecilia, and today is Sunday, November 13th, 2016. The tarot card for today is the Nine of Swords. I am not at all surprised to see this show up. However, it is not a card that I normally like to see. But nonetheless, let's talk about it. This is a card of fear, nightmares, all those things that keep you up every night wondering hmm, what's really going to happen what's it going to be like okay now let's bear in mind that tomorrow we have a super moon full moon in Taurus and the moon has not been this close to the earth in almost 70 years so while this is not an eclipse this is an extremely powerful full moon which will bring with it a great deal of change and if you want to even reference the moon card itself, it's sort of in the same vein as the Nine of Swords. You know, that fear that's there. And it's not always easy to tell how things will turn out. The difference is that with the Nine of Swords, sometimes we can let the anxiety take over and tend to blow things a little bit out of proportion let's hope that that's the case all right sometimes the energy just needs to pass and in a couple days everything feels good again so you know I do think you're going to see major major changes occurring at this time basically like a turning point where you will see new directions being taken maybe not by everyone but remember what I always say how what one person does affects another and it, it always winds up affecting you somehow so pay attention to the things that are going on and like I said don't don't worry about them don't over analyze them just know that this too shall pass and that you know the Sun always comes out again but it is better to do your best to get a good night's sleep Avoid the nightmares and rest. Very often, these simple energies, especially the powerful energies of the moon, can cause us all to feel a little bit off. And we start wondering, maybe we worry about things that it really isn't necessary to worry about. So keep that in mind. If anything is troubling you, know that when you get to the other side of it, you're more than likely forget all about it. And the energy will lift and you will feel much better. So with that being said, I'm going to thank you all for listening. Go out, look up at the sky, touch the ground, you know, ground yourself. It is a full moon in Taurus after all. And happy full moon, everyone. Enjoy your day.